all of that. I remember thinking, she's so beautiful. Esta familia hizo algo increíble. So we knew that Micaela was not going to be our first and only um, child that we bring into our family through adoption, but we knew that we wanted to pursue another adoption of another child when God saw fit. We had some friends that were, in January of 2018, they were in China uh, adopting their third child. And um, that is where they met our little girl, Zhu Yi Yi, which is now Isabel. And when they saw her, um, they knew her from a couple years ago when they adopted um, their first child. But they noticed a huge decline in Isabel's physical and mental state. Her husband snapped a picture, uh, and uh, she just prayed that God would spare her life. Día a día, la salud de Isabel se iba deteriorando en el orfanato por falta de cuidado especial. how sad and, and it just broke my heart I think I messaged Ginger and I asked her a few questions about um, Isabel she was five years old or almost five years old she was blind um, atrophy had set in in one of her eyes so she didn't have an eyeball she couldn't walk she couldn't crawl she was only bottle fed um, she was just in a terrible terrible state ella supo que tenía que hacer algo so finally, one afternoon, Stan was working, he was on duty, and kids were at therapy, so I asked him to meet me at, um, at a restaurant to go have a quick coffee, and I had Isabel's picture on my phone, and I just threw it at Stan across the table, and I said, I feel like God is telling us we have to adopt this little girl. I just threw my hands up on my head, and I was like, oh, Ashley, it's not time. Uh, we've decided, you know, we were going to wait later this year, we're going to adopt again, but it's too soon. Después de hablar con su hijo de 18 años, Stan se convenció. And I remember him looking up, our 18-year-old son talking to his 46-year-old father and his 40-year-old mother, and, and he, uh, he looked up and he said, uh, you need to go get her. Ellos viajaron a China para adoptar a la pequeña Isabel. Ahora Isabel tiene una familia cariñosa que le va a dar el cuidado y la protección que ella necesita. Cuando regresaron a casa, el resto de la familia conoció a Isabel.